Y un chalecón Y un blindado en todo terrenal Y un equipo No le tengo miedo a nada Ya conozco la jugada ¿Qué onda mi gente de YouTube? Es your boy Mike And today I'm doing a video with Renee's Daily Channel So right now we're gonna answer, answer your guys' questions from Q and A, and yeah. So what's the first question? What made you start a YouTube channel? The reason why I started it, I would say, is because just to have fun, pretty much. The reason why I <clears throat> wanted to do YouTube channels, cause th actually there's two person that inspired me to do videos. One is my homie Diego. Uh, he showed me how to like. He showed me like the way to do videos and everything, and like. I, at first, I thought like it would, nothing is possible until like he proved me wrong that everything is possible. And the other one is Jesus Ortiz. He's a singer from La Fuerza Regida, and he inspired me more to do like videos, vlogs, challenges, all that stuff. Plans after high school. So I w what I would want to do after high school is pretty much go to the military or. Hola. Or become a correctional officer. One of those. Those are my like plans or goals, I guess. My plans is gonna be what? Uh, go to college. Either go to college or work in the field, like for a year, <clears throat> and probably apply to college again. Basketball or soccer? Soccer. Soccer. Sport. Soccer's life. Yeah. Wait, okay. who said that question? My sister. Yeah, soccer's life. Be honest. How long are you gonna keep doing your YouTube videos? Until I wanna stop. Pretty much, like if I don't want to do it anymore, then I'll just stop. But yeah, pretty much. I don't know, like just keep on doing it. Like that probably inspires some other people to do it too. Let me see. What's your advice for someone get, who's getting bullied? I would say go tell a teacher if you're getting bullied, or like stand up for yourself. Go fight. No, just kidding. don't fight. Just talk to someone older. Like as a teacher or a principal, if not, then just talk to your parents about it. Just telling like what's going on, like like during school, because like you don't want to be alone. That's the thing. You don't want to be alone, and that's the hardest part of life. Trying not to be alone. Try to talk to your family. If they can't hear you or like know the reason why you're getting bullied, just talk to someone older, like or your brothers or your siblings. Like talk to them, telling like what's going on. Just. Don't do nothing, like, don't take action. Just think before you do. Think twice. Come on, guys. Action speak louder than words. True. How's life? Life's good. Yeah, I'm doing my goals so far. So, yeah. Life is pura joder, pues, tío. Es todo de joder. Neta, es joder. No se enamoren rápido. What's your biggest blessing last year? My biggest blessing last year, I would say was meeting my niece because like she's like half of my heart right now like oh, that's cute stop but <laughs> yeah that's my biggest blessing meeting her i would say my niece too because she's copying you nah nah families is always first like that's the first thing families is always first no matter what and thanks to her like she brought me back my happiness because yeah that's, that's what i said no se enamoran rápido do you see yourself doing doing videos YouTube in the future? Make your videos longer though. Me, I think that my my videos are like decent, you know, it's a decent amount. I don't know about you though. Yeah, I'm gonna just keep on doing YouTube. That's what I said. Just try to inspire someone to do the same thing. And I'm trying to make it longer. That's why I'm asking you guys to comment down below any challenges you guys want me to do. If you could go anywhere in the world, where would you go and why? I would go to Australia, don't ask, like, that's my dream place where I've been wanting to go ever since I was, like, smaller. What, what part of Australia? I don't know, just any part, just to, like, see their culture and nature and well, all that. I would go to, I would go to Mexico or Colombia, one of those two, just like, you know, or, you know what, I want to go to France or go to Liverpool, one of those two. If you can buy yourself a car, what would it be? Mine would be an Audi. Uh, I would buy a Dodge Challenger. Demon. Is soccer just a hobby for you? Or is it something you plan to do on the long run? That's your question. I don't play soccer.
Ay, pero qué idiota. <laughs> no, it's not a hobby for me. It's just a fun sport. Yeah, soccer is my hobby. And actually, I want to do that. It's like a long run. Just like to try to get better at it. Like, you know? Are you going to change once you, once you become YouTube famous? Mm. Mm, no, I don't think I would become YouTube famous. But, I mean, if I do, I wouldn't change. Like, it's just more likes and views but it doesn't mean anything pretty much i gotta say like for, to all the people like are making videos just don't let the fame change you you know just keep being the person that you are if not then you might lose like important people in your life like your friends family how would you describe yourself in three words i would say weird funny and mean pretty much funny annoying Alright, so one of the guys that uh, asked for the question, he said, "Tag me, tag me, SoundCloud on my link on this, my link on the description." So the shout out goes to Solo Rick, and I'm gonna leave the link on the description if you guys want to hear the song. <clears throat> From my perspective, is his song is kind of like it's kind of hard. So yeah, if you guys want to hear it. <laughs> If you guys want to hear it, it's, it's going to be like on the link in the description. Just, you know, just click the link on the bottom and listen to the song. Are you closer to your mom or dad? Mm. I would say I'm closer to my mom because she raised me longer. And my dad, he barely came in the picture like a couple, like a year ago. So my mom's like, I'm closer with more with my mom. Actually, I'm more closer to my parents. Both of them. Because... They're like our parents from the blood. They're the reason why we're here. And even though like no hates, you know, they're always gonna be our family. Yeah. Where is a good place to take a girl out for a nice date? I think a picnic at the beach. That would be good. I, I'm gonna be honest. Those type of dates don't they don't exist no more. They don't exist no more. You know why? Cause girl play too much. Also guys, I'm not gonna lie. Yeah. Guys and girls play too much. That's the reason why there's no nice date to go out. That's why there's no long relationship for that. So for my advice for you is, you know, just take her out somewhere, you know, doesn't matter where, just take her out. Try to make her happy. Try to be there for her no matter what. You know, if she's having her bad days, just ask her what's wrong. If not, try at least find some way to make her happy. How do you guys know each other? <laughs> well, we have this, well, we both go to Harnell class together, classes, and, um, well, we could text, like, our classmates on there, so I texted him, because, yeah, whatever it's called, and, um, I texted him because I needed help with homework, or whatever, and, um, yeah, after that, we just, we just started texting, and, like, we're like, oh, can we, like, do a video together? <laughs> so, the last question is, what is your friend's name, and how did you know? How did you guys became friends? Yeah, we, we, we became friends on class. Yeah. Yeah. Her name is <laughs> Renee. His name is Carlos, but I don't know why his name's Mike. They call me Mike. All right, thank you guys for watching our videos. Make sure yeah. you hit that like button and subscribe and turn on the notification on. Anything you want to say? Or? No, that's it. All right, guys. Um, Until next time. Thank you for watching. Sing a ring, 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 sing a